bigger gift than I this one, stop baby. Crying. I love you. I love you, baby. Three, four, five, six. First of all, are you toxic? I was kinda, but at the moment I'm a very changed man, bro. Welcome to Bed Palace Kenya, home of quality, affordable, and luxurious beds. We have also diversified to classic sofas. Visit our showroom in Vindigwa, Kiambu Road, opposite Quickmart, as well as Roy Sambu Thicker Road. Contact us on 0725 414 842. Bed Palace, the ultimate solution to insomnia. Hello guys, this is Mr. A lot more your senior Udaku reporter. And of course, a lot more is coming. Nico Maino Flani. Niki Cheki. My new near thick road, hapa, pal, green, kahawa, sukari, ukitaka mali, pazuru, na kuju, natulia, ni hapa, pal, green, wafanya, rusi, wedding, rura show, any event that you have. And somebody today, anatoka hapa, akiwa na furaha, tele, kwa nini? Shapi gwa bonge la surprise, la gari, Audi, Q3, Q3 mze? Q3. Q3. Watu wako hapa ni kona Anji, ni kona Bright on the PL. Uja mamu memchana sana online, but akamua, you know what? Let me reciprocate everything. Ukwaji Anji? Mwini ni kopoa. Uh -huh. Yeah. We're meeting for the first time, yeah? Yeah. Okay. But uja mamu kupenda sana. Every time tumekutana na ya niambia sujui nini. Ah. Sasema hiyo hapa. Mm. Bright on ukwaji? Ni kofiti, love the way, bro. I mean, ni good. First of all, uh, congratulations. I think you are the newest car owner now. Unaski aje? I'm feeling so good and I'm very excited. Yeah. Wana sema utoe macheno wa kuona vizuri. Tuendele sasa wa wa ICVP. Unaski a vizuri tena sana. Yeah, lata si amini but Did you expect this? No. I did not exit, exit, expect. Yeah. Mm. Brighton, kulia nda aje mze, wakati ulifikiri aje kumsurprise, ni kitu alikuwa nataka, ama kulia nda aje mze. Unajua, this, the, 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 yini kitu ambacho, ama ni kitu ambacho tumekuwa tukipanga kwa muda mrefu zaidi, ila sikuwa ni memuakikishi anta kuja kufanya jambo kama hili. Mara ya kwanza ni limambia wakati tulikuwa tunahama kwa yale ya maala ambayo tulikuwa tunakaa kitambo kidogo, ni kamambia mwenyezi munga kitu bariki takuja ku surprise na kangari kadogo tu kitakuwa natembelea labda kwenda shule na kuchukua mtoto kwenye kliniki kama mimi sipo karibu sasa tukapanga hiki kitu nilikuwa na director wangu anaitwa Rip Paul uh, Levin and Trish akina and Dave but wenye tulienda nao Mombasa ni director Rip Paul na Levin na Trish bila huyu kujua tukatafuta gari mzuri tu uh, tukona in the best na nikona in um, tosha ye kama mke wangu no. perfect Anji B leo ndiyo brighton na kulete hapa uliambua na pele kwa api ok director alikuja kaniambia kuna mali tunafai kufika na yeye brighton na minita but ata niambia ni wapi hivyo ndiyo wali niambia mm. na ukafungiwa macho wapi kunifungia macho Alianza kunifungia macho kitambo ni kachoka. Kwanza ni katua. Ni kamuambio na nifungia macho. Na atufiki macho. Nenda jutumetembea sana na choka. Ni kamuliza ama. Ukona ni ya gani uongea na bebe. Tondo ni kapigia bebe. Ni kamuliza. Ria ni letu. Ana nipeleka wapi juwa menifunga macho kutoka ni kujia hapa. Haka niambia. Kuna kitu enye. Ana indelea kupanga so. Wako. Yani wamesha agree. So ni kuje tu hivyo. Sama so, menifunga macho for long. Adi ni kuwa na kuja ni kikomple ni kimtetesha kwa gari. Mm. Umefungwa all the way kwa safari yote? Kuna mahali lifika ni katua. Tena ananiambia rudisha. Ni karudisha tena. <laughs> Anatoa, unarudisha. Ok. <laughs> Wevu sikuwa jinka jinka jinji. <laughs> ok. Uh, Anji. Tukiendelea. Wakati sasa ulikuwa mfungwa macho saka kuambio ufungwe macho. Nini ilikamu kwa kili yako? First of all, ni kwa najua, lazima ndapata pa bebu wangu. Jua likuwa menyambia atakuwepo hapo, yu ni kituwa kwaza ni kwa najua. Secondly, misi kwa najua, yani kwa kili yangu, hakuna kitu ni ilikuja. Yani nisema like, yani, 
Sijui niseme aje. Yaani hakuna kitu nyingi ilikuja. Niseme unajua wanapenda kunifanyia mchezo wa kuwa wawili. Sasa nikasema maybe ni zile mchezo zao wananifanyia. So ndio maana wakati nilifika nilikuwa kwanza namuita ni confirm kama Ali ananifanyia mchezo. Juu kuna siku nne pia alinifanyia hiyo mchezo but hakukuwa na kitu. So naona so nikafikia ni the same game wanatrai kunifanyi kunifanyia. Mm. Mzee, I mean, uh, this is a big achievement every manome angependa kufanya. Now that you've achieved it as of now, I mean, uh, what is in your heart? How, how are you feeling? Uh, mi kwanza ningependa kumushukuru mwenyezi mungu kumbwale ya metro bro. Mwana singe kuwa ni yetunge kuwa tumefika maala hapa. Naona ni jambo la busara ni mefanya. Ajiwa badala ya kupata kahela tunapiga shere pala inzi. Mini kuwa na badala ni piga shere wacha nifanye bibi yangu hapa awe na furaha ambao ningefanya na watu wengine pale nje ndio maana nikafikiria na nikawa na wazo la kufanya jambo kama hili ambalo nimefanya siku ya leo mm. perfect kabisa kuna kitu kingine ungependa kumwambia maybe ah uh, hilo ni jambo ambalo nime kuwa nikimwambia kwa muda mrefu kwamba nampenda zaidi vile ambavyo ni mke wangu na namshukuru kwa kila wakati maana unajua si wanawake wote bro wanaweza wapenda kidogo pale waweke masomo kidogo wakuzalie unajua mwingine pale na kidogo mimi imeingia pale unapata na kuambia beb tutoe lakini sasa yeye kwa maana alikuwa ananipenda akaamua kunizalia masomo akaweka pale kando kidogo akaniambia beb mimi nitakuzalia kisha baada nitakuja ku resume na masomo pale nimependa kumshukuru sana kwa hilo jambo bebusu mpekis ama mtaki nyinyi wataki wanasema <laughs> Levin kuja usamee hapa Levin kuja usamee hapa Kuja na bibi yako Trish eh tunasema wafanye nini Mimi nasema mimi kitu nataka au watu wakisiane for a minute Eh hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Trish na unasemaje Wakisiane <clears throat> for that minutes. Ai hiyo nae na choma. Ai ni sawa atutafanya hiyo kitu kwa TV. Levin, ni mkamba bibi yako sio? Wakamba wakamba wanajua kupenda. Kina sisi hawa. Kina sisi mzee. Sawa sawa. Nilikuwa nataka tuingie tupige story kama dakika tano hivi. Kuna kuna interview mlifanya pale tuko na ikakuwa na controversy sana watu wakakuita toxic watu wakasema sijui nini i mean uh, did you see such comments na zili affect uh, your well being oh uh, first of all are you toxic i was kinder but at the moment i'm a very changed man bro i was i used to be a very toxic man has it changed yeah nimeza kuona changes sikuze nikifanya makosa kidogo na niambia ni vile nime change wacha tu <laughs> <laughs> uh, so bro niliona anyway unajua hii kitu kufanya kila wakati hivi mnakosa na kidogo asira ya mkisi na kuingia pale si jambo la busara bana nikoendelea ni vema vile ambavyo nimeona pale kwa comment section watu wameniingilia sana wakasema PL mazio na tesa mrembo kwa mtaki sisi tu pia tuchukue mwana mali ni safi si hadi ukitazama ni mali safi bro mmoja muona mwangalie vizuri bado unakuwa mkamba eh mimi ni mkamba bro wakama ndo watu wanajua kupenda kwa hii dunia na wakikuyu na wakisi pia mnajaribu wajaluo kila mtu Kenya anajua kupenda tuendelee so nikoendelea ni vema ni badili mienendo brother nikasema hii mambo ambayo unasumbua na bibi kwa ishio ndogo ndogo bana nikaiweka kando nikasema sasa i want to be a role model to those other men wenye anakuanga toxic ndio sasa nimeanza na sitaachilia tena Mm-hmm. Kwa hivyo nyinyi mshaipigana. Kupigana kwa familia ina depend kupigana kupi. Hivyo ndivyo nilisema pale tu. Kwa lakini alisema at times nilienda to an extent that na nilikuwa nafanya physical inaitwaje? Si assault bro. Eh, hey, was assault bibi yako. Eh, hey, oh ne exaggerate bana. Eh? Eh? Yeah, yeah, some yeah, got some ka, ka, ka punishment kadogo. Lakini sasa wajua nimebadili. Yeah, I'm a different man bro. I'm a changed man. I'm happy for that. Thank you bro. I appreciate. Kiaribu kumiza msichana wetu mkamba tutakunyang'anya mzee. But she's a good wife. Unajua jamaa zile vitu wanamianga about wewe. I mean, mimi nimejua na Brighton kitambo kama ana kitu. 
Saa mimi maliku maliku sote yake ilikuwa imefika ndio yangu ilikuwa imeanzia. <laughs> Mjageti hiyo. Ndio nasema maliku sote yake ilikuwa imefika yangu ilikuwa imeanzia hapo sasa. <laughs> Tulikutana 2021 na bre alikuwa amebitu jamaa lakini sasa mimi nilikuwa nimebitu zaidi. But ni sawa Mungu alikam through. Mungu alikam through. Every time tumekutana na wewe anaambia ngawa na wake ni special sana mwanamke akiamua kukuzalia wewe ni mwanamke ambaye anakupenda. Ni mwanamke eh alikuwa anakupa. Alikuwa anakuambia mtu ambaye amekuzalia anafaa kuitwa mwanamke bomba. So mke wako ni mwanamke bomba na wewe wangu ni mwanamke bomba zaidi. Mali ubomba wake umefikia wangu ameanzia hapo sasa. Ulikuwa umeniambia uko na gift yake nyingine. Small gift by the way. Unajua sita sita mbaya uh, sita um surprise na a very nice gift like this one. Then alafu ni mwachie kama gari yake call amped kwa pale kwa mafuta. So nikaendelea ni vema ni hata kama eh, hata kama nimeshiwa kila kitu bana mwana kwenda pale bana kulala nje kidogo nilimwambia by the way nilikuwa kisi beba i'm so sorry for lying you nikamwambia nimeanda kisi pale kuangalia mind kama yamekuwa si ndio i'm so sorry by the way for lying na promise tena sasa kudanganya how come forgiven yeah you're forgiven so kuna potea so nikaanalia ni vema nikuje na kapesa kadogo tu kama mafuta beb yako kwa appreciate tu this one for the fuel thank you baby thank you so much baby Aki pesa wewe nikikupata nikikupata pesa wewe ehe wengi wanauliza for the very first time vizuri tu sorry tu atulieni tulieni tuko kwa tv watu wanauliza maybe ungeo tuko kuuliza gari ni pesa ngapi um naweza sema si gari ya pesa mwingi tu nika gari kwa pesa kidogo tu lakini kama pia unaweza taka kununua gari kama hiyo mimi naweza kukupa namba pale ufike pale mzungumze tu unajua kila mtu anazungumza kwa anazungumza kwa njia ambayo ni tofauti na mwingine pale yeah eh mlanga swali yangu lakini ni sawa tu kuna watu pia watasema ni kipindi ni script ni stunt mnajaribu kupull mpate numbers online watu kama hao wanawaambia nini ah jambo la kwanza ningependa kusema kwamba kwa wale watu ambao watasema hivyo ningependa kuambia jamani msikose kutia bidii mkiwa na bahati basi pia wenyewe mnaweza fanya jambo kama hilo lakini for this one it's a very special gift to my beautiful wife unajua i can't come to the public nianza kudanganya kwamba nime surprise na gari alafu kisho kisho kutu atakuwa anapanda pikipiki pale akienda pale si tuseme clinic itakuwa mbaya sana bro utakuwa na mwana na gari itakuwa perfect itakuwa gari yake ile NGB you are your final words kwa Brighton tukimaliza hii interview Beb mm-hmm. <laughs> Nisa kwambia thank you so much mm-hmm. for whatever you have done to me sikwa na natarajia gift kubwa kama hii mm-hmm. though ni promising kutoka kitambo and what i know wewe unaongeanga vitu wewe ni hard working man ukisema utafanya kitu wewe unatimiza thank you baby Juve tu mingi unaniambia ndafanye hivi una ukimaliza target kama vile umenua sahi gari unaeka target nyingine unaniambia next project yangu ni ina hii na finally naona ngo kifanye hivyo so na ku appreciate sana kwa kunipea gari kama hii ju temu nilinua filda uniambia ni yako si ndio mm. na nikakwambia baby ulikuwa umeni promising me to utanibaya gari wa kwanza mm. mbona sasa umeenda against ukanyamaza nyamaza ukaniambia usi usijali si ndio yeah. So sikio leo kunipea gift kama hii na kushukuru sana and I promise to be there for you mm-hmm. and I will be supportive malinda weza mm-hmm. na mungu pia kujalia nikimaliza masomo yangu nikipata kazi babe I promise to give you a bigger gift than this one I love you, one, I, love you. I love you babe calm down I love you so it's okay baby sorry baby da ah, basi basi si tushamaliza tufunge virago vyetu twende nyumbani maana ni usiku na ni usiku wa manane mtu wangu uh, thank you so much uh, brighton and congratulations once more anji for this na kazi nzuri mzee kazi nzuri mzee
Thank you, bro. There are so many people looking up to you. So nili kupea iyo 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 two hundred iyo two thousand ya juu utakuwa na itumia iyo four thousand ya juu utakuwa na itumia wakati nenda maybe car wash unawasha tu vizuri for the meantime Manuel wanza kujitagemea tena sawa welcome baby welcome baby welcome baby so Baruhara kulea, kusta ilia bebi na kupenda. Saa. Bebe, bebe. Saa. I love you. Love you too and more. Ah, basi shaisha. Yuko soko mwanzo, watu wasija wakafukria ni mtoto bana. She's my wife bro. We are married. We have a very beautiful baby. A celebrity one. Her name is Aviana B. Ana tesa pale mbaya sana. Just just like a mom. Ni mrembo sana. Mm. So wako wale wa labda wanataka kunyakua mali yangu hapa. Eh hey, maze. Alafu wajue wewe ni wajue wewe ni mkisi. Wajue mimi mkisi brother. <laughs> only legends can understand. Wao wanaelewa. <laughs> Levis unajua? Wao <laughs> wanaelewa. Uh, thank you so much guys for your time. Uh, I'm really inspired by this because of you know mambo ni mengi muda ni mchache ya thank you so much guys for watching mambo ni mengi muda ni mchache nilikuwa nikipiga story na brighton the pl na mke wake hapa anaitwa anji wako na mtoto mmoja celebrity sana mzee for now it is a bye bye mr lotma will be back with some other amazing content bye bye